bus pass? Where do I where do I, where should I go? Uh Mountains is seven. How do I Ah! One bus ticket. Yeah. Okay, take me to seven. Where's my goddamn bus? Oh there it is. Is this it? Gonna get mugged by the bullet vibrator robots? They do not look like bullet vibrators. Okay, they do look a little bit like a vibrator, but it's like, come on, we can't talk about that. Let's, can we keep, let's get, let's see, let's keep things civil in here. Am I right, folks? You know, isn't it being a comedian so hard? Because then it's like when the line between being funny and going too far, that's always a scary line, you know? You know, I'm always putting myself out there being an adult, but it's like, what if, what if you just do the wrong joke? What if you do the wrong joke? You know what I mean? I'm always like out here breathing. But what happened? Conservative comedian. They always, they do actually always start like that. Well, you know what? I'm not like those other comedians. They're like, comedy is going too woke. What I think is this, wait, where am I? This isn't it. No, I'm not. It's not about getting canceled. No, it's like, like, you know, they're like, what if I say a no, no word and everyone hates me? What I'm saying is what if, what if a streamer as a joke, you know, they were like, what if they played video games with like a vibrator in? And then they were just like, LOL, it was funny. It was a joke. Like that's too far, right? That's what I mean, right? It's not like, oh, parentheses, like culture's gone too far, parentheses, racist. It's culture's gone too far, there's a vibrator. Do you understand what I mean? You get it, right? You get it. No, I'm not asking you if you want a vibrator bit. Yeah, that is how I would get canceled. I would, I think like, oh, it's funny if, if I, if I streamed five hours of, of like, I don't know. What if I streamed five hours of the coin game with a vibrator up my ass? And then at the end I was like, well, sorry guys, the vibes were off. And then I, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> no, no, no. Let's not talk about that. Let's not talk about that. I just want to go to the mountains. The vibes were off. Let me take out this vibrator. <laughs> Am I at the mountains? Okay, this is where you want me to go, right? But see, then I'd get banned from Twitch, then my career's over, then it's like, well, I got banned for having a vibrator up my ass. Go ahead, YouTube. You know what? Clip it. Go ahead, put that on your little Twitter or your little blue skies. Go ahead. And when they ask, oh, who's that streamer? Who's that blonde streamer who's playing coin game? You'll say, that's my streamer. Parentheses. Vib vibrating Vinny. Wait, isn't there another comedian streamer? Named Vinny? That's my streamer. She talks about vibrate. No, I'm not trying to tell you guys anything. I want pizza so bad. This is so cool. What can I get for you? Give me the pirate pizza. And the pirate. I want the punch. Alright, let me get right on there for you. Thank you. I like this game a lot. <laughs> I just. Why'd I have it from. <laughs> I think I had it the wrong way. Is that Spongefella or Spongebob? Oh, who is this? Pirate... Pirate plunder. I want to plunder. How do I plunder? Oh, drop the balls? I win 120 tickets. Woot! I really like this game. It, you know, that's the beauty of a game like this. It's like, this game is so, ch like, charming and sweet. It really makes you forget that I was just talking about having a vibrator up my ass, huh? Chess vibrators? I would never shame somebody for using a vibrator while playing chess. You know, I saw people, they were playing like Ultra Kill, an armored core with like vibrators. And you know what? I want to make this very clear. Your streamer's very sex positive. I, I believe in, I don't care. Just do whatever you want. You know what's great about being about being a trans femme content creator with a lot, a huge, you know, trans audience. If Northern Lion or Germa or any of your other faves be like, hey guys, ever shoved a vibrator up your ass? Or they're like, whoa, it sure sucks having something in your butt, huh? Everyone's like, what the fuck? But I know if I say it in here, my community will be like, that's so true, queen. Keep it up. And that's why I like you guys. My first time here, <laughs> what was that about? Can someone explain for me? I don't want to talk about it. 
Someone, someone explain for me. I like it when people explain for me in the chat. It's okay to have shit up your ass. I didn't say that. Well, it is. What, what way do you mean? <laughs> you know what? It is okay to have shit up your ass because it doesn't matter what shit it is. All that. Fuck me. I didn't mean to click that. You know what? Let's let's bridge the gap. Let's get some let's get some cis gendered and queer gendered thoughts in here. Just take care of yourself. Maybe listen to that one song, Frankie Goes to Hollywood, for for that. The one about zerking it? No, it's not about zerking it. Relax. It's about relaxing. Relax, don't do it, meant butt plugs. I mean, kind of. I think they were talking about, like, don't stress, you know? See, that's what I- that's the good thing about my community, is we can tell each other about these things. Yeah, it's literally about relaxing your butt. Yeah, don't strain. Could you imagine that? I mean, don't doctors already kind of do that? They're like, uh, nice to see you, miss... Nice to see you, miss, uh, Hancock. You've been very tense recently. Here's a butt plug. I don't want to talk about butt plugs anymore. Coming from your fighting tutorials and seeing your stream for the first time, it's quite a different vibe. Well, that's the old me. I need to go to your doctor. Well, I mean, like... I don't know, doctors are supposed to prescribe you things to make you feel better, right? Like, I got a medication for ADHD, did you know that? And then, you know what? It's like... I mean, if I'm ever like, oh, my back hurts, or like, take this for your back. You know? Or I guess they would be like, oh, you should probably take the butt plug out, huh? <laughs> do you say these things? I'm just having fun! My ADHD is kicking in to check the butt plug. I mean, that happens, right? It's like, oh, I'm too focused, I'm too focused, I can't focus on, on too much. And then you're just like, well, fuck. I forgot the butt plug. I'm so in. Okay, thank you for teaching me about butt plugs and vibrators. I don't- I didn't do that, did I? I was just saying, that's what we can- we can talk about that here, if, if you guys want to. Explain to us to, how to find the right butt plug. What? I can't do that. They say everyone's body is different. Oh my, you are bad at putt-putt. Fine, I'll sh I'll kick it. No, I'm not high! I'm just playing! Move. She's less coherent than high. Oh, less incoherent. That's not true. Fuck off. Fuck off. Just give up. No, I'm not giving up. <laughs> You're kidding me. Streamer can win Evo, but can't hit a ball. Stop to- what did I tell you guys about bringing up Evo? You know, I think I've mentioned this many times, but one of my scariest thoughts is like someone's gonna post like a clip of me from like last stream having like three bods on at once and they're gonna be like can you believe this fucking idiot won an evolution can you believe that she won evo really it's like remember when that someone made that tweet that was like imagine being a young like christian boy looking up the new testament versus the old testament and finding my video see that's kind of charming because it's like you know what that is kind of funny but when it's like, look at how great this, this streamer was before, and now she's old, and she's talking about butt plugs on her stream, and she's, there's like three of her at once. Like, that's not really my reputation that I'd like. I'm not joking when I say this. That, that is, give me the hole in one. Hold on, I'm going to give you the hole in zero. Watch this. Fuck me. <laughs> you really struggle to find the hole. <laughs> I'm not replying to that. Yeah, let's keep it wholesome. wholesome, wholesome. But fuck Oakley, man. No, I didn't say wholesome like that. Not like up your ass. I meant like wholesome, like, oh, I'm feeling whole now. No, I'm not. <laughs> can we relax? How about we just talk about, oh, can I shoot? How about we talk about, well, what were we talking about before? No, we weren't talking about butt plugs. It was about Evo. No, I didn't cheat at Evo with a butt plug. I just played the game. I just played, that's, that. this is the problem. You know, back then, I didn't, I wasn't silly. I was the opposite of silly. I don't think I ever made a joke in the year 2019. But th that's not me anymore, you know? Oh, I love... Let me make something very clear. I think when people bring up that I've won Evo in the context of my stream, 
it's embarrassing because I don't, it's like, I don't know. It's a weird, it's a weird perspective. It's like, I've helped a lot of people with fighting game content. And I'm really glad that I did, but it's also a different part of my life now, you know? But now, because I'm so shameless compared to where I used to be, when people are like, oh, remember when she won Evo and she was like a hard ass and she was like sweating all the time? Dude, that's just embarrassing. I don't want to remember that. Yeah, I was a hard ass. But like, you need to, ex you have to, you have to understand. As an introduction to me, if you're just like, this streamer talks about butt plugs and she won Evo, people are going to come up here and they're going to be like, well, this must be a pro streamer for for fighting games no dude i'm playing coin game and talking about things up your butt let's let's just keep this civil that's what i'm saying do you understand what i mean oh i'm proud of it it's a different part you know your streams are a lot more fun than back in the exit days well i agree i have a lot more fun with them too you want to see my bed is that what you want is that a vibrator on the pillow? No. There's no vibrator. <laughs> well, I don't know. Maybe there was a vibrator. Maybe someone put it there when I was looking. How am I supposed to, like, I can't, you guys have to understand when someone's like, oh, there, if someone's like, there's a fire behind you. I would look because it's like, well, I don't know. No, stop making these allegations. Why would you say I have a vibrator in my possession? I don't have that. And that's none of your business. No, my vibrators. No, I don't have one. No, I don't have a vibrator. I don't. I don't. I've never had a vibrator. I don't even vibrate. Jorba has something up his- Ooh! Cow! Cow! No! There's a little critter trudging behind you. I'm not lying. Where the fuck is the critter? Made you look. Oh, you guys, you guys are like, you know, in, in cartoons, uh, look behind you. There's, there's, there's a, there's an, uh, there's an emergency behind you. There's an emergency behind you. Yeah. Congratulations. You did get me. You lied. You lied to me and took advantage of my trust. No, the critter did not take my butt plug and I don't have one. Stop saying that. Why are you guys, why do you guys think I shove things up my butt? I just said I support people who do it. Cause why, why shouldn't I? Cause you're so cool. <laughs> if this was Germa's chat, everyone would be banned. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. I'm, I'm Germa for adults. They think about butt plugs. I have deep respect for anyone who puts something up their ass. Do you know what, what, do you know what kind of person it takes you, it takes to have people in culture constantly say, they're like, oh, you got a bug up your butt. I remember when, I remember when Walter White said that, you got a bug. You got a bug up your butt. And then you still chose to have something up your, put something up your ass. I love my stream chat. You guys, you guys are the real, you're the real heroes out there. You know that? Quote me on this. People fight for freedom. You're fighting for something else. And then you're, wor it's, you're winning. Yeah, you guys are the real heroes. You know what? I, come on, there's got to be at least one couple watching my stream. Can you guys just fuck already? I got to have something entertaining happening in chat. Mods, can you cut her mic? Oh, so you guys, when you when I, when I you guys bring the heat, it's like, okay, well, whatever. I, I can say all that. <laughs> it doesn't even matter. But then when I say it, you guys are like, what did you say? What did you say? Cut her mic. What? Why, why is she talking about male, male impregnation and, and butt plugs? Where are you? Fucking square? Come on, bud. Kids were talking about that when I was 10 years old. Yeah, gore, she's talking about male impregnation and butt plugs. <laughs> Mickey, do you know anything about that? I hate that this is the least unhinged stream she's had in a month. Is that true? It's just butt plugs. See, this is, we need, we need more. This is what I'm saying. We need more sex positivity. Cause we're like, we fear, we fear something up your butt. Why? Why so cowardly? I just told you guys, if there's like a gay couple in the chat room, if, if there's a figurative butt plug in a butt plugger, you know, then, you know, go to town and then like, let us, let the chat room know about it. We're supportive, right? Right guys? This is what, this is why everyone hates the left, by the way. Because we always say, oh, let's be woke, let's be supportive. And then as soon as people start talking, fuck off. As people start talking about their ass, everyone's like, I don't really know about that. My, my, my reactionary values require me to be, uh, yeah, whatever. Hold on. Now get him. Now cover me. 
Hey, why do you think they don't let 28-year-old women play laser tie like this? Hold on, grab you. Oh my god, I'm bench pressing this bug. KDA, 3.2. <laughs> Biological advantage. Yeah, when the conservatives, they're like, when they talk about sports and shit, what they're really talking about is me in the laser zone. What happened to Ch chess? I got tired of losing ELO. I hate chess. That shit sucks. I hate games where I have to think. Yeah, quote me on that. Go ahead. You know what? Next time when you make a little funny, your little funny meme tweet. Oh, my streamer won Evo and now she's making funny content. He <laughs> he. Here's a video of her talking about a butt plug. And then you can add, by the way, she hates chess. By the way, chess sucks ass. It licks balls. In fact, it licks my balls. So aggro today. Well, you guys, you guys got me in that mood. I'm not playing chess with a butt plug. Push game to go. Okay. What? What is happening? I'm pushing button to go. Should I say something? No, I'm not gambling. Podcast time? Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to Ramola's. Ramola's classic little podcast, the Ramola Rainstorm. And boy, we're coming in hot. Weather's looking cloudy today. And boy, I gotta tell you guys, the podcast of the day title, we're talking about butt plugs, butt plugs. And by the way, why don't we plug our attitude for this one? Because we got a lot of attitude from everyone on our podcast last week. But this time, we're going to make sure to be nice and really chill. <laughs> this is a weather channel. Can you just put a vibrator in your pocket? I don't know, maybe. Hey, stop talking about butts. It's getting, it's getting kind of weird in here, guys. Come on. Streamer can run. Streamer can run. Streamer can run. Streamer. Streamer. Streamer can run. Streamer. Streamer. Streamer can run. Streamer. Streamer can run. Streamer. Streamer can run. Streamer. Streamer can run.